Bonjour, bonjour, this is Zareiler and welcome to this new video on the Call of Duty World War II Beta. So this is to give my impressions and also uh, a description of what this um, game mode will look like, the mode War, which is a very, very good surprise. So it's 12 people, 6 against 6. How does it work? So War Operation Breakout, attack or defend all the mission objectives. So you're going to do both on one side and on the other. Um, so you have four objectives that you have to defend or attack. Uh, in a row, and um, the defense needs to prevent you from doing so. So um, I'm going to start out. I haven't shown you my classes, but with the M1 Garand, which is in the infantry division, and I realized that it was not a good choice because I thought I was uh, attacking. So uh, I'm going to start with the... So the point is you have on your left here, you have a command post, and you need to defend it. Right in the middle, look, you, you see it's already 70% on the top left, almost top left on the left. And the point is to prevent them from going into the command post uh, without any contestation. Uh, contestation? Yeah, like So um, if there's defenders in the house, the percentage doesn't go up. If the uh, attackers are alone, it goes up until 100%. Then you go to the next zone, so it just kind of it moves around. So as you can notice on the bottom right, the uh, kill strike, the kill streaks, the point streaks or whatever you want to call them, I get destroyed with this one. Yeah, people get prone. Drop shotting is horrible, and it's coming back in this game. I'm gonna give my impressions after that. Um, what was I saying? What was I saying? What was I saying? Uh, so, and after that, you go to a different place where there's a different objective. For now, there's only one. Get out of my house! Not in my house. Um, there's uh, four objectives. There's only one map in the beta. But um, oh yeah, I was saying there's no kill streaks or point streaks or whatever you want to call them uh, because you have your own other ones that sometimes go in terms of a package that come from uh, the sky, obviously. Uh, this is an amazing game. This is really good. So like, we lost the objective, so we have to go back to the bridge. This is a tough place for attackers because they have to build that bridge. And you'll see that I'm going to make a massacre with uh, one of the things. So it's a second weekend. Uh, it was recorded during um, the weekend just now. So I played. I had one weekend to play and I know where to go. So I knew that I could do a few kills just waiting for them here. Um, it's very static. It's on, on defense. So you get sniped and you get... You get LMG and you get killed a lot. Uh, they don't put your ratio, your KD. It's not put. The point is to do as many points as you can, one way or another. It doesn't matter how many times you get killed, uh, though it's probably going to influence you. So I went back to a sniper. It's a semi-auto sniper. Uh, so you'll see. I'm going to lead you with the the images, the video, um, you can check, but at the same time, I wanted to talk about my impression of the banner. So, like I said, it's the second weekend. I've done the first weekend fairly... I played a, a bit, not too much because I was not around too much, but at the time, they changed a few things between the first and the second, including this uh, static LMG that uh, overheats much faster than before, but still has limited ammo, so you can massacre them uh, if you're a little bit good with it. Uh, you're fairly easy to snipe, to be perfect. So the smoke is really, really, really important on this map. Um, so what do I like? I like the fact that it's set in the Second World War. I think it's a good idea. Uh, that it's boots on the ground. It's really good. Yes, you have drop shots, but apart from that, it's like the old times. But they still try to put some modernization, like the war and everything. Um, the, 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 the weapons seem balanced uh, in general. There's nothing about maybe the STG-44, which is a, a rifle. Uh, is it a rifle? Yeah, I think. Um, that is uh, really, really good, but it's really good, but it's you can use the other ones, like the M1 Garand, or I don't remember what's the other one, that can destroy you. Uh, the life is good, as you can see, it's good, it's not too small, it's not too big, and the regeneration is a bit slow to come back to full health, but I think that's supposed to be in order to stop much rushing. Um, it encourages a bit of camping to, to be perfect on as well, especially in these game modes. But even in others, I found a few people during a hard point, no hard points in the game, for example, but during team deathmatch waiting for you on the corner. This weapon is quite good actually. It reminds me of a, a weapon from a Modern Warfare 3 that I used a lot. We lost, they managed to build the bridge uh, fairly fast, I must admit. Um, so you have to go back and fall back to the ammo depot where they're gonna have to put a bomb like on SLD. Um, the connections. Well, the connections were not excellent on the first weekend. I seem to find them 
better now, but my connection is good. So I'm in my new flat, new house, new room, whatever. And um, from what I've seen, they are okay. At least for me, they are good. I don't have a lot of BS. I don't get not too much. Very rarely, I'm like, oh, uh, I shot first or everything. So this is fine for me. If you have a weak ping, you're going to suffer in this game. Uh, there's no um, dedicated server. So if you don't have... Uh, if you don't have... A, there's a tank is arriving. If you don't have a, a good connection, well... You see here, isn't the tank... Boom! No head. Mm. So the hit scan seems to be better from the second weekend. They must have um, improved something. That was me. That was not him. That was me. And that was... Yeah. Um, the kill streaks are not too powerful, but they are still useful. Uh, look, all in all, it's really good. There's lots of things to say. It's a beta. There's a lot of things to improve. And uh, and Gondry uh, uh, just uh, seem to have started to listen to people. Um, they are trying to think about what we love about the the previous uh, Call of Duties. Um, it's fairly beautiful. There's a lot of detail. The animations are okay. Uh, the variety is there. Um, you know, I think they really put an effort on this game, and um, it shows. So you see, different ammo dumped. So in 18 seconds, the bomb is gonna explode. This is one of Kill Streaks, uh, the flamethrower. Yeah, I wanted to go defuse the bomb, and then you see, you get killed. Five, four, defuse. Three, two, one. Diffuse! I was so close, that was good. Um, but anyway, um, yes, my impressions are good. I know I've seen some uh, YouTubers do not agree with me, especially when you play in groups. So you have to know that I only played solo uh, because I'm on PS4 now and I don't, I don't have any friends. So for now I played solo. It seems like in team, the connections is actually... is actually not great. Drop shot. Uh, but we'll see later. What I can see is like the, the work that was done um, ahead in order to prepare this beta is good. Uh, the division system, which changes the class system, is good. It restricts you, and I think that's good. You can do anything you want. So like, if you want to be uh, stealthy, you have to uh, uh, you have to give up on something else. So you, um, I, it's hard to explain, and I don't have it on video. But you have five you know, infantry, armored. A mountain expeditionary and something that I forgot. Anyway, and you have skills that are linked to this class, and you can have weapons linked to this class. The weapons level up in order to get your uh, accessories. So you can see we all they put the bomb again. Uh, what can I tell you? It's a beta, so um, if it reflects the future game with a few modifications, I think it's going to be a really, really good year. Um, about my, my gameplay, it's not a great one by any... I, I died a lot of points, but I died also a lot. Um, I haven't played a Call of Duty in a year, and it shows <laughs> also. So I, I've got, there's a few moves that are alright, and, and I'm doing alright, but there's so many people that are better than me. He destroyed me with a shotgun. Um, about the bad stuff, some people complained about the flame uh, shotgun. I don't mind. Uh, I haven't seen it that much, but I don't mind. I used it. To be perfectly honest, it's, it's honestly fun to put people on fire. <laughs> That's the way. Um, but it's not going to prevent. There's only four bullets of a thing. You need most of the time two to kill someone. Yeah, man. Uh, if you know I'm here, you can't do that. You have to jump or you have to do something. But right now, it's not going to work. Um, so, yeah. Uh, I think that's mostly my... Uh, my opinion about the beta, I like it. I like it and I can't wait to play more. Um, there's a new map for this beta, so if you don't know, the beta is not going to be open at any point, so at least they, if they do, it's going to be a surprise announcement. For now, it's only if you have a uh, code. Uh, by the way, um, if anyone... Um, I don't know, I was about to say I have a code, but uh, by the time you see this video, the beta will be over. Too bad. If you have any questions, of course, uh, ask them in the comments. I'm going to try my best to tell you everything I know. Uh, some people say the feed, the kill feed is not great. It's not great. It's a bit ugly. It's a bit short for the feeder. But I don't like the feeders because it's dumb. I don't like the snipes. Uh, I think the snipes are only, should only be used in like the war mode. But anyway, or uh, something, take a position. But I don't want to see 
snipers move around and do script scope and it's actually possible. So uh, that's not good for me, but I understand that the snipe community is quite big on Call of Duty, so yeah, whatever. So someone can go into the tech. This was a good session. I destroyed them. This is the STG44. It's this is it? I don't know. Oh, I can't see it. But this is a good weapon. So the point, if they are not close to the tank, the tank nut doesn't go forward. So you have um, some um, static LMGs, but you can actually destroy them. I don't think it was the case on the first weekend, so I think they changed that. There's a lot of grenades. Probably too many, and not that you don't have any way to prevent the damage or to stop them from exploding because there's no trophy system and whatever. So that might be a problem, but for now, I didn't feel it was that much of a problem. You know, grenades were part of, uh, of previous games. Uh, he knifed me in the back, that was not cool. That was not cool. Yeah. He almost got me because I stopped shooting. I thought I had him already. Their tank is pulling back. Oh, my grenade got someone too. Don't let them destroy our flag I see a few uh, in, in picture problems, and I don't understand why. I'll see if it's still one. If it's the case, I'm sorry. I can't do much about it, I think it's the Elgato, the OBS Elgato beta combination that was not great. If I have another 15 seconds, so I'm falling back, boop, behind, successful withdrawal, and we are nail them. 26 seconds, you are not going anywhere, so the point is to be around, to make sure that they don't go next to it. Yeah. 50 kill with the M1 Garen, which I really like, I really like this weapon. Ah, and that's my thing. The MK something from MW3, that makes me think about it. Um, so, is, well, I, I haven't explained everything. So, basically, you are, this is the last step. So, you have the depot, the first thing, then you have the bridge, then you have the bomb, and then you have the tank. And if you bring the tank all the way, then it switches, and the team that does it the fastest, if they both finish, won. Or if the none of the teams has finished, it's the one that went the further. It was a... Ah, I wanted to knife him. But uh, I will post other... Um, victory! I will post other gameplays if I have something good. For now, I only had a meh one, which I don't want to post. Uh, maybe that's going to be my only one for now. Anyway, the Raider is back from the summer, and I hope you liked this video, and I'll see you next time. Allez! Au revoir.